We've seen not just millions and not just hundreds of millions, but literally billions of dollars pouring into new technologies that hopefully, maybe one day, will help to save the planet. Wind and solar, that's currently growing about 20% per annum, and that's going to reach 40% of global generation by 2030. Now, if that growth continues like this for another six years, we're going to reach 8,000 gigawatts of power in 20 years, which is equivalent to all the global fossil fuel capacity amassed over the last century. The key really is how we combine some of these technologies together. So we've got batteries going with wind and solar, and hydrogen obviously has its place in the system. It's how these technologies connect together over the next two decades, which tells us whether we're going to win this climate battle or not. We have technology right today that every chief executive and every chairman of any industrial company in the world can take and step beyond fossil fuels. It's available now, it's improving fast, sure, but get in the game.